We're finally in the month of December 2023 is coming to an end and well with the month of December rolling around now we know we're going to be getting some new content being added to Marvel Spider-Man 2. We're going to be getting some new suits, we're going to be getting new game plus and some more and maybe even some bug fixes which is part of the reason why I'm trying to get this video out as soon as possible because I want to get ahead of this glitch being fixed because you see we all are dying to replay that Venom mission. That's one of the things that I know a lot of people are hoping that we get out of a big update here in December. The option to replay missions is something that Insomniac has mentioned publicly that they are working on and that will be coming to the game, which is great. We're going to be able to play that Venom mission over and over and over again. You don't have to worry about starting a new save and then creating a manual save before you start this mission like I have. But you know what? Having that manual save of the Venom mission has become the gift that just keeps on giving. At first, people found that there was a glitch when you're fighting Craven in the Venom versus Craven craven boss fight to actually jump up and get out of bounds and then free roam around the open world as venom and it was just cool to you know be in the marvel's new york sandbox as venom and jump around get on top of rooftops and just see what the character looks like in that environment and it just created that hunger for people to want this to be an actual feature in the game it all gave us the nostalgia from the ultimate spider-man days where venom was a fully playable character that you got to free roam around the open world with and sadly that venom free roam glitch ended up being patched and it was mainly because of the fact actually that it sometimes would corrupt your save file completely now some people may not have cared too much about that and i understand if you were one of those people but at the end of the day a glitch is a glitch it is insomniac's job to make sure they get rid of these and you can't really fault them for doing that but you gotta give credit to the community for their persistence because they found a new venom free roam glitch and this time it actually allows you to free roam around the city and fight crimes this new glitch just lets you have fun in the open world and it's awesome and i'm gonna teach you how to do it and hopefully by the time this video is out it hasn't been patched big shout outs to groovy weeb over on the spider-man ps4 reddit for being the first one to have brought this to my attention and to help some of the people in the comments about how exactly you do this the first step actually is to hit that like button on this video make sure that you have a manual save from the playable venom mission i think a lot of people that are watching this already probably have done this especially if you're one of those people that wants to just go back and play that mission over and over and over again so that you can have fun playing as venom as many times as you want my personal recommendation though just because of how specific this glitch is going to get is that you create a manual save when the actual cutscene begins after you beat Craven, because it's during this cutscene where you do the most crucial things to allow this glitch to work. Because you see, you're gonna let that cutscene rock. You know, Harry's gonna go visit Emily Osborne's grave. He's gonna talk to his mom, and then the symbiote is gonna manipulate him and show him a little bit about what it means to heal the world. Then you get this cutscene of Venom on a rooftop, and then he jumps off, and then after a few seconds, the screen fades to black. This is where your swiftness is required, because it's during those two seconds of the screen screen going black that you actually need to go to your home page and then close the game there's a few things i did to actually give myself more time here to actually make this glitch work the first being to put yourself in fidelity mode it just gives you a tiny bit more time that you're gonna need and the second is well with practice knowing when that black screen is coming up so then you can actually go to the home screen sooner before you end up seeing the fade to black and close out of the game at the right time you'll know that you have done this glitch successfully if when you go back into the game and look load up that same save file where you were playing as Venom and then have it just start with Peter in the city instead of it continuing the next cutscene where Peter is digging himself out of the rubble. What you want to do at this point is just go to any of the side activities that are available in the open world, whether it be a hunter drone or a Craven base, whatever. Just obviously make sure that this side activity is something that you can engage with as Peter. Then after you've started the side activity, just abandon it and boom, it'll switch tonight and you'll be playing as Venom in the open world. And it's so cool you could just fully free roam around marvel's new york as venom and crimes will pop up that you can go to and sometimes actually the symbiotes will pop up since it's at a later point in the game where you're supposed to see the symbiotes sometimes show up during random crimes so as venom you can take down the symbiotes it's so much fun now sometimes when i'm trying to get on top of buildings and i'm just jumping repeatedly i end up glitching inside of a building all you got to do from there is just restart your checkpoint 
It's actually really funny. Sometimes you'll see Venom perching on like a light post. It's hilarious. And believe it or not, I actually think if you shut down your game and you load up this save again, it'll still continue you playing as Venom. Now, disclaimer, I don't know if this glitch ends up corrupting your save files. So beware if that ends up happening. Obviously, this is a glitch. You're not supposed to do something like this. So something bad could happen to your save file. Just be careful. What I ended up doing when I was done, when I had my fun with Venom free roaming around is I just loaded up a save again from when the venom playable mission started so that i can just go back and i can try and do the glitch again if i ever wanted to or i could just have my fun playing as venom in the mission but man free roaming around new york city as venom just makes me want insomniac to work on a venom game so badly i would love to see that happen it would be so cool just to see what they could do with full-on traversal for the character in an open world setting and it looks like insomniac has hinted they've teased that they might end up doing something like that in the future they're talking about how they're going to listen to the fans and see how we react to that venom playable mission in the game so my fingers are crossed but with that being said let me now kick it to you guys sound off with your thoughts in the comment section below are you going to be trying out this glitch are you excited that you get another opportunity to free roam around as venom in the open world and also do you want a venom game sound off with your thoughts in the comments if you enjoyed the video hit that thumbs up button i've been caboose i'll see you guys later